Hey, welcome back, everybody. Welcome back for another one of my retro remix remade dive videos from my 25 years in the diving industry. Today, we're going to be traveling to South Carolina to Lake Jocassee. It's a beautiful lake in the northwest corner of the state, a few hours from Atlanta. And since it's still early in the day today, we're drinking Snake Eyes Energy Drink without vodka. I love Red Bull, but it's $2.99 for one of those little punk ass shooters. These are 99 cents each for a full size can. We're ready to roll. Let's go. Most of the video and photos you're going to see are from the Devil's Fork State Park. And some of this footage is 10, 12 years old, so a lot of it looks like it's from an old security camera. One of the coves of the lake has been set up as an underwater park, so scuba divers from neighboring states can come and train and practice their underwater skills. At a depth of 30-40 feet, there are underwater platforms that are used as scuba diver classrooms where they practice their skills. Some of the groups have decorated the platforms with signs. There's nice diving in the coves. There's some shipwrecks and there's lots of fish to see. But as you follow the topography downward into the river valley, you find a very different environment. There's no sunlight below 100 feet, and a submerged forest lies in perpetual night. The massive trees stand in complete darkness, but their branches reach upward to a green twilight. It's a beautiful lake now, but when it was built in the 50s, entire communities were forced out and they're paid just a fraction of what their land was worth so that this lake could be built. Below 150 feet, you start to see evidence of those communities, including a graveyard. Well, it's time to ascend. I want to thank everybody for sitting through my video. Like, subscribe. There'll be more content coming. If you want more information on Devil's Fork State Park, there's a link in the description. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon.